good, apocalyptic family? It's your boy, it's Apocalypse. Now, today, I know this is a little weird, but I'm gonna be reacting to a vlog. And what am I talking about? I've reacted to vlogs before. Anyway, so I'm on B's family channel. And for those of you who don't know, this is the new channel from Bugatti Bees, aka Bees, also known as Beezus. Beezus Christ. Alright, so. The title of this is, My Little Brother is Out of Control, I Found This in His Room. I'm curious, so, so curious, that I figured why not bring this to the channel. So without further delay, before we get started, brothers, sisters, uncles, aunts, nieces, nephews, and the apocalyptic family, let me know what you want me to react to next, and I got you. I got you. Alright, let's go. Bro, you see Bruh. Oh, hell nah. Oh, you gonna have to run that fade, nigga. Oh, ho, ho, ho. That nigga leaving shit. Hey. That bell. Watch the full video. That was cringy. I'll never do that again. I say that now until I do it next video. <laughs> What's buzzing, y'all? What up? Bees, man. Back again. What's buzzing? Oh, with another uh, banger. You feel me? He tired as hell. That nigga tired. Oh. So, lately, right? Mm hmm I thought my dad was playing lately. Um <clears throat> been like talking to to Jeremiah and shit. And That's his brother, y'all. Jeremiah's his I, brother. I don't know, I just feel like he um I just feel like he's he was he was like doing good for like a little minute and then it's just like he just like took a whole nother turn and start like just acting weird and like messing up and stuff you know what i'm saying like oh, a shit. couple of his friends or whatever got expelled from school right he's doing some some crazy stuff like fighting oh, fighting no. and just other bad stuff that you're not supposed to be doing at school right and um I'm like overprotective of my brother, right? And I don't want that nigga to get expelled for something stupid. I don't want him to get expelled, period. But especially not something stupid. You feel right. me? Right. So, um, I don't know. I just feel like he's, I just feel like he's not organized, man. Or like, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, I remember the last time, like, okay, I was reading the comments and y'all was like, man, you just need to let him do his own thing, blah, blah. So I took y'all advice. Shit was cool. He was doing his own thing. I was letting him rock, whatever. Wasn't saying nothing about nothing. And was just, you know what I'm saying, letting him do his thing. I mean, when you're an older sibling, you're going to be overprotective. It gets to a point where, like, you you kind of got to say something. Like, something has to be said. You feel what I'm saying? Something got to give, and right. I feel like it's, it's... Somebody trying to add me on PlayStation. I just feel like if... If I continue to allow him to just do his own thing, he gonna start running over people, right? Mm -hmm. So he got on punishment the other day, um, basically for like back talking to his parents. Why I don't know, or just giving like nonchalant responses to like certain things or whatever, because he overslept. Mm -hmm. Um, so so let me tell you the whole story. So he slept. He slept, when he came home from school, like right now it's like 4, 4.52, but he would come home from school usually like around like 3, 4 o'clock. He came home um, the other day, maybe it was like two days ago, said what's up, um, we chopped it up for like a couple minutes, and then this nigga went in his room and went to sleep for the rest of the day. Like, until, like he, he didn't eat dinner, he didn't do nothing, he just fell asleep for the rest of the day. And, um... He woke up at like two, three in the morning and I was up. Right. 
and I was up, and I was making like food and stuff. And this nigga woke up, and this nigga made a bowl of cereal. I was like, damn, nigga, you been sleep like this whole time, like whatever. Woo -woo. And then uh, he met, he ended up missing the bus. Bus coming like six of them or seven or whatever. This nigga ended up missing the bus. The fuck, you missed the bus. <laughs> that's what him and his parents got to an argument about and like they ended up like grounding him and whatever so he pretty much like can't be in his room or whatever but at the same time like there's been like a crazy smell coming from like his room I don't know what the fuck it is but if y'all don't know like my little brother's like he's crazy unorganized bro like it's it's, it's almost disgusting almost this nigga leaves like plates and bowls and all type of shit in his room for like days and days and days like his nigga does not know what a trash can is because he is a trash can this nigga he he doesn't utilize the garbage can he doesn't keep a bag or anything in his room to like you know what i'm saying like just just keep it clean like if you go like even me right so i don't know if this is just in black households but like i keep we keep like a bag of bags like grocery bags and shit like that. So in my I room, keep that. like in my closet, I have a I have a bag like that and it has a bunch of grocery bags in it. And I'll take the grocery bag and I'll put one of them like on the corner or on my doorknob. And then like, because I drink a whole bunch of water and stuff, or just be having like random trash sometimes, I'll just put it in the bag until the bag fills up and then I'll go recycle it. Cause I really only put like plastic bottles in it. Just so they not like- I'd be like that. Or whatever. I'd be like that. You know what I'm saying? Just to keep my room like clean. And stuff like that and me being like a big influence on him i would much rather him have like a clean room because that way you know what i'm saying i wouldn't mind buying him expensive stuff like the stuff he'd be wanting like new shoes when they come out stuff like that i'm not gonna buy that for you if you can't even keep your room clean why wow, so they can be hanging from the fucking ceiling with a piece of gum holding it up you see what i'm saying like i'm not gonna do that <laughs> and, um, it's just it's just getting to a point where i'm just like I'm getting a little bit annoyed, and I feel like I just have to step in and actually say something to him. I think you should. I don't want to, and I know y'all probably don't want me to either. No, I and think you should. Day, you know what I'm saying? It still is my little brother. You feel me? Because like, if it go on still, any longer, it's going to get worse, and you're going to say some other shit. Still my brother, bro. And I can't I can't have him fucking out here just tripping and shit, man. But I Nah, know. I think he should say something. He's here. What y'all think? His room. Oh. I think he's in his room. Let me see. I think he do need to have that talk though. If it's getting out of hand like that. Gotta be Metal Gear Solid. Yo, this shit kind of spooky. Oh, I remember that from the beginning of the vid. What the f Oh. Oh, that nigga. Oh. He's a garbage bin. What is you doing, bro? <laughs> bro, what is this? What is you doing? <laughs> what you mean? <laughs> Dude, you're stealing my candy. Stealing your candy? <laughs> what? Oh, no, I'm not stealing your candy. There ain't no candy in here. I didn't might be candy. Nigga. <laughs> Bro, you got a bowl in this bitch. <laughs> you nah, this nigga was looking for candy. Oh, my God. I'll be looking for Snickers. They ain't right here. What's, what's you doing, bro? <laughs> Oh, that nigga is nervously right. angry. Yeah, oh, oh. That nigga nervously angry, oh, yo. Yeah. Like, nigga. 
Nigga, when? 10 years ago? Look at this. <laughs> 10 years ago. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yo. When was you gonna put this in the sink? <laughs> when they're not down there. <sighs> put it back for you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done with this little nigga, bro. Cereal? I'm done with this little nigga, bro. Look at this milk. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> Come on, man. Whoa. You live in here. <laughs> you live in here. <laughs> Yo. What the fuck? You stay in here. Clean your damn room. I'm not laughing. Who the fuck are you? Nigga, you clean your room. How? If I can. With your hands. What do you mean? Bruh! Hands? Okay, guys. There's been a like time serious, where like, I was unorganized too. Right there, like, and my room has been messy, but not like, like that. The weekend mixtape cover. <laughs> but no, nah, clean your damn room. Look, this shit is. What? You got a bag. You don't even use it. What's inside of it? It should be that. There you go. A bowl full of milk should be inside there. A bowl full of milk should be in Get rid of Okay. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> You're stalling. Uh, <laughs> you think I'm stalling. Clean your room. I see what he's talking about oh, with the wow. nonchalant shit. Clean your room. Ooh, go clean your no, room. No, bruh. Bro. Stay here and clean your bruh, room. Bruh, bruh. Oh, uh, bitch! You live with me! <laughs> like. You gonna leave? So I can clean my room? Bruh! Stop clean it right now. Oh, oh hell, hell no. Yo, this little nigga out his mind. Progress. Happy bitch. Yeah, just just walk. Just walk, cause you gonna, you gonna fuck that nigga up. Y'all hear this little nigga though? Bruh! This isn't my first time on the channel, by the way. I've watched their vlogs. I just thought about reacting to this one. But Jeremiah getting out of control, man. Drop the top, eh? to the Listen, I don't blame you. I don't blame you. I don't fucking blame you. Yo. Okay. We can't sit here and flex like none of us have never had a messy room at one point. All right? But if your shit like that, come on, man. A bowl with milk still in there that's probably soggy as hell on the floor, my nigga. And you never thought to get rid of that. And not to mention, you just toss this shit around. You live with your older brother in your older brother's house. In your older brother's house. And you're like, who is this nigga, bro? And then you, you're getting smart. Like, okay. I'm not gonna sit here and be disrespectful. Cause I fucks with bees. I fucks with Jeremiah. I fucks with the bees family. But Jeremiah out of control, yo. In my opinion, I don't think it was wrong for bees to say anything or to see what was going on because this is what he was talking about in the beginning before he went in the room about Jeremiah lacking and shit. About how he started having changes. Not in a good way either. Like, I don't know what's good with him, but 
hopefully things get better. Hopefully they have that talk. And hopefully Jeremiah understands. And if there's some shit that Bees needs to understand, hopefully he understands as well. But y'all subscribe to the Bees family. Link in the description along with the original vlog below. Also, if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to this channel. Become a member of the Apocalyptic family. Leave a like if you enjoyed this reaction. Comment below what you thought about this reaction. I'll see you soon. Deuces.